What's up, everybody? This is Chris, and this is my channel, Barn on 11970. Thank you for checking out this video. All right, guys, what a surprise. There are riots going on now in Ferguson. Now, um, here's an interesting connection, and you can see with a video that I will post in the description below of a video I made over a month ago. I was talking about an interesting situation, possibly in gold and silver, um, on the November 30th Switzerland uh, referendum, where they were going to vote to see if the Swiss banks had to buy back I think $16 billion worth of gold that they've basically stolen from the Swiss people. And I said in that video, watch either a week before or a couple of days after you would see kind of some kind of event that would distract people from this event. Well, six days before, all of a sudden we have this Ferguson um, grand jury. And I posted an article in a video I made today that was saying that I thought it was strange because somebody in on Facebook said the verdict was soon to be announced. And I saw a USA Today article that was talking about 30 minutes before the verdict ever came out that they already knew what happened. And then the timestamp on it changed. So I already have it documented that this happened beforehand. But I was talking about over a month ago, when I was talking about November 30th as a key date for people to look at, well, now there are going to be riots in Ferguson, and there are going to be people that are going to be, you know, the mainstream media is going to be focused on this event for God knows how many days. And this whole referendum that's going to happen on the 30th could just potentially just slip under the cracks and go unnoticed. Now, um, Six days beforehand, is that a coincidence? I mean, sure, it could be. I'm not saying otherwise, but it just doesn't surprise me that some kind of world-worthy news event just happens to happen less than a week away to what I thought could be a potentially very important gold and silver, well, gold video, on and the, what could it change the economy potentially if they voted yes, which I think actually they'll find a way to rig it so it won't end up with a yes vote. But this is one heck of a distraction. So is this a setup? Is this a false flag? Who knows? It could be just coincidences. I'm not here to say either way. I'm just giving you information about things that I've spoken about, your ability to research and check and verify themselves, because I'll post the link in the description below of the um, video I made about a month ago, and uh, see for yourself that I even talked about this. What a surprise. So, you know, you draw your own conclusions, but, you know, the average person now is going to be glued to the mainstream media tell of vision, and they're going to believe everything that's presented to them because their whole life is based on belief systems instead of self-verification. And um, this could potentially slip under the fingers of the, the rest of the world noticing what's going on in Switzerland, which is going to happen in less, less than a week. So, interesting. But I'm sure all the things I talk about just happens to be coincidence, right? Peace.